What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another All-Star Tower Defense video. Now, I was playing UA yesterday and I kind of got up to stage 6, so we're going to try doing UA and I'm going to try and solo it. Now, I know a lot of people don't want me to solo it and it's going to be very hard. I know it's going to be very hard. I actually haven't soloed UA before. So this would be very interesting if I can even beat this. Uh, but I want to beat UA. I think we fight all for one. I'm not 100%, but let me go check real quick. Yeah, so we do fight all for one. Uh, and I, I heard that UA6 isn't that bad. Um, I'm going to try doing a Jotaro uh, Ryu Aaron strat with Balma, but I'm not going to use Balma till like midway through. I don't want to use Balma until we get a little bit uh, more upgrades because I don't think that Balma off the bat is going to be a good strategy with this one. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm going to try my own strat with uh, putting a Jotaro down and I don't want to put him into a straight line. I want him to kind of be in an area where it curves. That way he gets more chances to kill things. I'll show you when we get in. But our main goal is to beat UA and to get the UA mount because I want to get the UA mount and I want to beat UA. So this is going to be quite challenging, but I'm pretty excited to try it. Now, if you like this video, make sure to leave a like. Um, if we reach, you know what? This is going to be impossible, but if we can reach 500 likes... I'll do a huge gem giveaway to random people. 500 likes. If you can do it, just like the video. And, of course, subscribe if you guys are new. I'm trying to reach 50k by the end of the year, so it just would really mean the world to me if you could just hit that subscribe button. But, without further ado, I'm just going to go right into this. I just... We're going to go right into it. I'm not even going to stress, not even going to talk, not even going to plan. We're just going to go right into it. I don't expect to beat this first try, just letting you guys know. Again, I don't have a strategy for this. I'm just kind of going in blind. And I know UA is pretty difficult, so we'll see. And I don't have the best towers in the world. Okay, so I don't want to put it in a straight line because Jotaro won't do as well. Maybe if we put him... Hmm, maybe if we put him right here. Yeah, let's put him right there. I feel like this is a good spot, actually. The reason why this is good is because they don't go in a straight line. They have to go in a complete straight line and then turn and then have another turn. So it gives uh, Jotaro time to kill because he has a 5 second cooldown. Which, you know, isn't the greatest in the world. And I might honestly go for his second upgrade instantly because then he can still one shot. Okay, this is a yikes because he hasn't actually... We're gonna get some runners, I'm assuming. Now I'm gonna try not to skip uh, because I'm doing this solo and I don't, don't trust myself here. So yeah, so we're gonna get some runners and honestly they... M okay, no, they won't get through. They only have 25 health, so we'll be good. Then we can upgrade him. There we go. Okay, not too bad. We're doing a lot better now. And again, I'm not going to skip because I don't trust myself. Um, unless we need the money instantly. We're going to put him on strongest as well. Um, and then, you know what? Do we put another Jotaro down? No. Okay, we'll put. We'll now start putting Ryus down as well. She should be able to get some of these guys. Maybe not all of them, but she'll be able to kind of slowly take them down. Wave 3, not too bad. I know it's just wave three, so it's not like we're really missing too much. Okay, so she can kill, which is good. If this guy gets through, that's completely okay. I don't actually mind if he gets through. Okay, we'll put another Ryu down here. And then... Let's actually... We're gonna we're gonna go through this one. And hopefully, we can get enough money to... Okay, can you kill this last guy? Yes, okay. And now we're gonna get an Aaron real quick. There we go. So we're going to use Aaron as a backup. That's the only reason why we're going to actually use him is strictly just for a backup for the little strays that do get past. Um, we should be doing really good with the Ryus here now. They should be able to get pretty much all the kills except for the powerful guys. Okay, not too shabby. We're doing okay for a solo with no plan at all. And I'm now going to get a Balma going. Um, I guess we can just kind of put her anywhere. Aaron's Titan should be able to take down some of these guys. Then we will upgrade this Ryu. Hopefully she can kill these guys. Yes, she can. Okay, not too bad. Also going to upgrade that Balma. Should get an extra $100 here. There we go. We'll upgrade this Ryu as well. And then any extra money, we'll get another Balma going. Uh, and then we just gotta, we gotta grind out money because this way we can try and get... Um, Aaron's going at the last round. We might have to spam him. And I also want to put a Jotaro over here so we can time stop. That's kind of my plan. Um, we should upgrade Aaron here. And we should get some extra money here. There we go. Um, and then we'll upgrade that Balma. And we should still be okay this round. Because we still have Aaron coming as well. Which, which is health out. Oh yeah, okay. So he has that max health. 
And these guys are doing not too bad. Aaron has upgraded. So we sh still should be okay for this round. The Ryus are going to kind of come in clutch here. Uh, I'm going to I'm gonna actually upgrade a Ryu just because I want the AoE damage. That's going to help significantly. There we go. Come on. Need enough money to buy an upgrade for Bulma. So she's actually useful. There we go. We want to get as much Bulmas as we can before probably wave 10. Or 11, actually. I'm going to say 11. We also got Aaron coming in. Okay, I'm doing a lot better than I thought I was going to do. Not going to lie. Doing way better than I thought it was. So we're going to save until we can get another 750 upgrade on Bulma. Um, yeah, this cloner should be completely fine because we have Aaron coming through. Good old Aaron coming in clutch. There we go. Got another Bulma upgrade. Those Ryus are coming in clutch. Ah, uh, she's such a good tower. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Okay, they're actually super slow, so Jotaro's actually going to be able to kill them. Well, should be able to kill them here. So we're going to do that. Ooh, got it just in time. So now we're at 1,000. Um, I guess we can upgrade this Balma as well. I don't... Yeah, we'll upgrade that Balma as well, and then we'll use any extra money to buy another Ryu. Let's get one of those ready. <laughs> just the little whirl whirlwind sound to hear. <laughs> And we'll get another Balma. Actually, we'll get two Balmas. Got to make as much money as we can. It's kind of our main goal here. Just so we have like a big spare of money when it goes to wave 15. Because we're going to need it. It's not that bad, honestly. Th like this run is not too bad. I know that pillar is going to be incredibly difficult. But uh, UA, this this run's not doing too bad. And I feel like my strat's actually pretty good. I know that that's a really good Jotaro spot. And then the Ryu's just, ugh, they're so good and they're so cheap. So like, they're just super easy to use. You know, I'm actually going to go into the next wave. And then I'm going to purchase these. Now, I'm not going to buy any more Balmas. Um, but I will do another upgrade real quick. So we're going to save for $1,500. See, like nothing's getting past these guys. They're so good. Why are they so good, man? They barely even need any help. Should get a pretty good chunk of money here. There we go. 24. Ooh, okay. So I'm actually going to put one of those down. Give him a little upgrade because base Aaron honestly isn't that good. High waves. I would like to get a Colossal, but I don't really want to spend my money on it, to be honest with you. But we'll see. We'll see. They're so good. They barely need any help either. Sheesh. Super good towers. I highly, highly suggest getting Ryu. I said I wasn't going to upgrade another Balma, but I did. Okay, we're gonna put another Ryu down, and then I'm also going to sell this Jotaro because we don't really need him there anymore, and we're gonna move him right here instead. Um, that way we can do time stop. So we're gonna we're gonna just upgrade this guy next round, completely up to time stop. And if any strays get past, that's why we have the errands as well. Yeah, one more upgrade for Jotaro. I just spent more money on a Balma. I know I said I wasn't going to, but I just. I'm so greedy for money, man. Gotta get that bank, you know? It's okay. We'll use mob money to purchase the upgrades for Jotaro. We don't really need Boma money for it. I'm not going to skip any waves now. Um, strictly just do because we're on wave 13 now. And I do want to do a little bit of prepping. Okay, there we go. We have time stop now. Uh, we have two errands as well. Uh, I'm not going to upgrade that one. I'm just going to keep it to a two level. So we can get another Ryu. The amount of wind that's happening right here. The one downside to this, uh, to this tower is that you can barely see what's happening. Yep. And then the strays will be completely okay because, uh, my errands will take care of them. Here's the boss. I guess we can time stop him. It doesn't really matter if we use time stop now or later. So we will do that for now. Get her upgraded. Get this money situated, and um, I guess we'll just max out our Ryus. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so I do have eight now. Um, I guess I can do another upgrade. Balma, just for this last round. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna actually save up to get this Aaron completely upgraded because I want to get one Colossal. I haven't done a lot of solos by myself. Like I haven't done a lot of solos in this game. Um, I've usually played with people or did like some duos. So, doing stuff solo is kind of fun. Okay, there we go. We have a Colossal Aaron now. There he is. Good spawn time as well. And then we're going to save all of our money. We ain't going to spend a single dime. And hopefully we can get to wave 15 here. Yeah, yeah. Once we get the money from these. Okay, now we're going to sell all these because we're not going to need them for last round. Wish there was an, a hotkey to sell. That would be really nice. And then I guess we can do some uh, some Aaron spams. I'm not a huge fan of the Aaron spam. It is a little cheat, but I'm not going to do a lot of them. Like, I'm just going to go to 10k here, which I guess is still a lot. Like, this is a lot of errands, um, but I don't want to, like, overly abuse it. So, um, and then we're going to put a Jotaro down, and then we'll wait for the boss. Bulma's just really OP. Like, 
it's such a good tower. The like the fact that you can get this much money in a round is insane. Well, I guess not really. You do have to sacrifice using like physical power, uh, like physical tower. So I guess it is kind of good. And there we go. Here is all for one. Oh, we don't even have to use time stop. Wow. Yeah, okay. I didn't, I thought we would actually get through all these errands. I guess not. We didn't. I don't know how we didn't get through those, but I thought we were gonna, <laughs> I thought those ones were gonna die. I didn't, I didn't think it was gonna be that broken. Well, I guess we did have a lot of Jotaros and Ryu, so we're doing a lot of damage anyways, nevertheless. But there we go. We have beat UA Dome, and what I forgot to do last time is show the mount. So this time I will show the mount, uh, so you guys can see it, uh, even though you probably know what it looks like. We'll get that out of the way. And here we go. Oh, it's the Hawk Wings. Yeah. Okay. This is a really cool, uh, really cool mount. It's one of the cooler ones. You get to fly. You have wings. It does look really dope. It's really, really cool. Uh, I might stick to this one. This one's kind of cool. It kind of fits with my color scheme. It is a little red. Uh, but the shuriken is really cool. The shuriken is really dope. So I don't know. We'll have to see. I but the hawk, the hawk wings are really cool. It's probably either my first or second. I don't know. They're very close to first. Ugh, super, super good. Let's see who is on the summon unit. Nope. Nobody I want, so it doesn't matter. Um, so next episode, I'm either going to probably try trial mode. Um, and then also we have to work on um, story mode as well. We're, we're kind of getting close to end game on story mode-ish-esque. Sort of. We click uh, here. So yeah, we have... Hyoko Mundo, and then we have Pillarman, and I'm very, very scared for Pillarman, I'm not gonna lie. It is pretty scary, and I don't know what they're gonna do for the next story mode. I'm assuming you're probably gonna have to have a lot of, like, pretty good upgraded towers. I don't think you're gonna be able to really beat it with, uh, base towers. Speaking of which, I have to do some upgrades. I haven't been upgrading my towers, like, at all, and I really should be doing it, but I'm not. Um, right now I'm trying to get 100%, uh, Deku. Um, I also want to get Rukia. And I'm also trying to get Broly, so quite a bit to go, but those are kind of like the main towers I want right now because it would insanely help with uh, Pillarman. So I have a whole nother story mode to go through and hopefully we get some of those towers and before we get to Pillarman and obviously I'll keep you guys updated. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I had a lot of fun. I honestly surprised myself. I thought I was going to do a little bit worse than that on UA, but I have really good towers, so granted... Uh, it was alright, and uh, we might have found... Ooh, we got a fan! Look at repping the merch! What is up? Hi! Oh, there's a bunch of people joining. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, as well as subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out, Girl Scout.